Hi everyone, it's Roger here from What's On DisneyPlus.com. A quick news update for you guys on clouds hitting number one on iTunes. But before we go any further, make sure you do hit that subscribe button to keep up with the latest Disney Plus news. So it's Monday. At so it's Monday and I wanted to jump into some of today's big Disney Plus news. There's a few little stories that I wanted to bring up. So at first, following the release of Clouds on Disney Plus last week, the actual song by Zack Zobrick has actually already gone back to number one. Bit of a surprise, wasn't really expecting this to happen, but I suspect a lot of people did exactly what I did after watching it, going on and watching or listening to it, and then probably listened to it a few times. I think it's fantastic news. It's raising money for charity as well while it's there. And yeah, just the idea of having this at number one really shows also the power of what can happen when a movie like this gets released. And just extra um, love for Clouds and also for Zack. I just think this is such a great story. Moving on from there, we have got confirmation from the actors of the Disney Plus original series Diary of a Future President that they are now on set and filming the second season. So hopefully that will be coming at the end of next year. I really enjoyed the first season. You'll find it all on Disney Plus. And if you look at the actors and stuff on Instagram, you'll find pictures of them sort of showing them off. They're all kind of socially distant. They've got their masks on. They've been having tests, etc. But it's great to see this one going on, especially since it was a little bit doubtful if not this was going to be happening. Also, just a quick note to say there's going to be a new Mandalorian trailer dropping this coming Monday night during a football game. You'll be able to watch it on ESPN. And we'll obviously have it all over the internet right afterwards, but it's gonna be dropping in the middle of the night for me, so I'm gonna be finding out what it is in the morning. Can't wait for it because it's dropping next week. We're getting the new series um, next week. I can't believe we get it's that close for the new um, Star Wars series. Can't wait for that one. We also did get a trailer yesterday for the upcoming short Once Upon a Snowman, which um, looks fun. Can't wait to see that one there. And finally, some UK news for um, November, there's been a couple of release dates um, brought out by Digital Spy, confirming that Noelle will be coming to Disney Plus in the UK and Ireland, and it'll also be rolling out on other countries, I suspect, as well in Europe. On November the 27th, it makes sense to kind of get it in just before Christmas. They didn't put it on when Disney Plus launched back in March. Kind of made sense. You don't really want to put too much publicity into a Christmas movie at Easter time, so they kind of held it back. So fans in the UK will be able to check that movie. I think it's a really fun Christmas movie. And there's also some other good news for the UK subscribers because we're going to be getting Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Season 7. The first two episodes will be dropping on November the 13th with new episodes dropping week to week to week. And this is the final season over here in the UK that actually hadn't aired anywhere. So this will be the first time we get to see it. I'm looking forward to it. I've completely caught up on the fact fast six seasons which are available on Disney Plus over here. Unfortunately in the US there is a bit of an issue with streaming rights um, where it's going to be on Netflix for a while first. So there we go that's kept you up to date with some of today's biggest Disney Plus news. Make sure you do hit that subscribe button to keep up with the latest news. Go check us out over at whatsondisneyplus.com. Like, follow and subscribe and I shall see you guys in another video. Laters.